to get out here. Not as easy and straightforward as yesterday's par, so work to be done. Oh, tidy looking shot that. Pretty straightforward four footer coming up here. Always nice to hold those for a birdie. Our current leader is up by a whopping seven shots now. The lead is getting bigger and bigger. I'm pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. Yeah, it's heading to the bunker for sure. And he's not hit the mark on that approach. Oh, the wind wreaks havoc with another golf ball. On the green now, but a bit of work left to do here. This putt is of nine feet. Okay, steady now. This is a bogey putt coming up. Yeah, well hold. Let's move on to the next. He's currently sitting in first place. You've arrived at a par four. This one should find the rough. Just off the fairway in the first cut. I'm telling you, I would blame the caddy. Bogey here yesterday, looking at the same score today. Going with the 9-iron, nine -nine, I think. It's fair to say that that approach didn't hit the mark. Now, coming out of the rough, missing the green was always in the cards. Oh, what a wonderful bunker shot. Nicely hold, and for par. Now seven strokes up after that hole. Here we find ourselves on the tee of a par four. Do you attack it and try and increase your lead, or do you lay back and play safe? I like to attack it. What do they like to do? Time to take their approach shot into the ninth. Yep, give yourself a pat on the back. This putt coming up is for birdie. Oh, gee, that line was looking good, wasn't it? Three feet to go here to the hole. And the putt drops, and we're moving on. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. Let's see what happens here at the 10th hole. Going with the seven. Hoping for a bounce here, preferably to the left. Well, it's found the surface, but that's about as much as you can say about it. Outside chance here for the birdie. This is from miles away. Ah, that's a shame. Comes up shy. Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hold. And this next putt, it's for bogey. And well hold. Let's move on. Still in the lead now after that hole. We have a par five here. Time to take advantage. This looks to be heading for the cut stuff.
time for the second shot at the 11. Opting for the five wood. That ball looked a little thirsty. And here we are with their four. Well, I hope he makes this one. It's for par. Wow, that's misjudged. And that'll be a bogey. Two bogeys in a row, never a good sign. Now playing a little defensively. Our current leader enjoys a five shot advantage. We have a par four on this one. Uh, not quite the shot he was wanting. John's down on the course, and do you have a better look at this lie? They are very deep into this rough here, guys. I can't even see the ball from where I'm standing. Look out. Getting ready to play their third. This would be a momentum saver here, getting this up and down. Just six feet between here and the hole. And there it is. Now four shots up after that hole. Let's see what happens here at the 13th. Going with a three wood here. Well, this one looks like it's heading to the sand. Not sure if that's what they're intending to do. A bit short with that effort. And here we are with the third shot. And back to the course with the live action. This next one from the beach. Well, what's he doing hitting it there in the first place, Luke? I don't understand. He made bogey yesterday, and he's looking at the same score today. Six feet remaining to the cup. That's a good putt for par. You'll take it. Currently 12 over for the tournament. All right, getting into our final stretch. Time to tee off here at the 14th. Uh, this one might just sneak off the fairway. Well, Rich, this looks like a familiar spot for this player. Yes, and let's hope it's not a similar result as yesterday. It's fair to say that wasn't their best shot. And that's been the story of the day, isn't it, Luke? It has missed a lot of greens, and you can't afford to do that on this golf course. Oh, I like the look of that shot there, Beamer. You better believe it is great stuff to watch. Yeah, good putt. Well hold. And now that finds him in first place. We have a par three on this one. Opting for the three wood. That's not the outcome they're after. 
Well, definitely the wind had to have gotten a hold of that one. Yep, that'll work. That's fine. Pretty good chance here. This one's for par. Oh, just missed. Putting for bogey. Well, that hole's behind us. More to play. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Just a few holes to play. Let's see how you handle the 16th hole. Oh, well struck. This drive's heading for the fairway in my eyes. Looks like a similar approach to yesterday. Same spot as yesterday. Will they have the same results today? That's a great shot here at 16. It sets up a chance for birdie. Almost a gimme birdie there, Luke. Fantastic. Gee, making this look easy. Keeps surging ahead. Our current leader is enjoying an eight-stroke advantage. And now teeing off on this par four hole. Well, I like the look of the line here. It should find the fairway. Luke, unfortunately, that got a horrible kick. Ended up in the rough. Looks to be going with a hybrid here. Oh, that's out to the right for sure. Oh, that's a little wayward. Needed to take a little less club on that approach. Yeah, you hit a beauty, didn't you? Just 10 feet to the cup here. Oh, wonderful effort. Confirms the par. Now, eight shots in front. Here we have a long par four. It's going to take two great shots to get on. Good-looking shot, this. Playing this shot from about 230 yards out. Back into the wind. They need to flight this one down. This one looks to be bunker bound, Rich. Not good. Getting ready to play their third. I'm pretty sure he'll be happy to be back on the green. That was a gallant attempt. And this one will be for bogey. A bogey to finish his round. And as the third round comes to a close, they're in that enviable position of top spot, Rich. Oh, it's been sparkling, hasn't it? It's been a pleasure to watch. It's got to be a little strange, though, having such a massive lead because there's only one way to go, and that's down. Let's see how they handle the pressure on the final round. Well, that just about concludes our coverage. On behalf of Rich Beam, I'm Luke Hill. to a coverage here on 2K Sports. We're at the Tributary Championship. Today's coverage is about to start. Delighted to have your company for this final round action. Hi, I'm Luke Elvey, alongside Rich Beam. It's been great to have your company here. And Rich, we're into the final round now. What's our next player dealing with as they get it underway? Never easy going to bed with the lead and 
they're out here today. It's probably weighing on them a little bit. I got to say, though, this player has been playing well. That's why they have the lead. So they have to be excited and they have to like their chances going to this final round. Can't wait to find out what happens here. Let's see what kind of tone he sets for himself today. Wonderfully played. Looks like a similar approach to yesterday. Unfortunately, it is the same as yesterday. Hopefully, they've put the results yesterday away. Well, this is one of those lengthy putts. John, how do you see it? It looks like they're setting up, as far as my calculations at least, like 40, 45 feet. And that putt will end up short. Make sure you get both the line and the speed right here. It's a long putt. Uh, a bit long on that one. Playing their fifth shot. Oh, I thought that one was going in. Well, at least you're not punting for triple. Let's make this for double. Yep, that's disappointing. Getting underway over par. That never helps. It's time to begin this powerful hole. Well done. And this shot from about 150 yards out. Good shot there. Slim chance here for birdie, but you never know. This one looking really good. And that should secure the par. Well done. Let's take a look at the leaderboard as it stands. And staying right where they were in today's rankings after that. You've arrived at a par four. Step up to the tee and own it. Where did that come from? That's not his style. Now, man on the ground, John McCarthy. What's this line look like, mate? They are into some deep, deep rough here, fellas. Let's watch, see what they can do. And that's for birdie. Well hold. Oh, that settles the nerves right there. Great stuff. He sits in first position. And I don't give the rest of the field much hope today. Our leader is way out in front in this final round. Looks like they've got the five wood. And approach didn't seem to fit their eye. Coming up a little short with that effort. Not bad, though. Oh, great shot. Holes out for a birdie. Nasty lie out of the rough, but look at this in the hole. Can you believe it? Currently plus 13 for the event. And I don't know if the rest of the field is up for catching them here today in this final round of action. Teeing off here at the fifth. That's heading for the fairway. This shot 
is about 140 yards out. Choosing the 9-iron nine here. Uh, that was a little untidy, wasn't it? Straight into the water. Playing their fourth shot. Yeah, that one will play. This putt is about 10 feet from the hole. Ooh. Oh, dear. This next putt now for double bogey. And down it goes. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. And I don't give the rest of the field much hope today. Our leader is way out in front in this final round. Here we are at the sixth hole. Looks like they put a good swing on that one. That should find the short stuff. And here we are with the third shot. What an opportunity to make a birdie. Oh, so close. Putting for par. In she goes. Let's head to the next. Sitting at 15 over for the event. And I don't know if the rest of the field is up for catching them here today in this final round of action. We have a par three on this one. Chosen the pitchy wedge here. Didn't quite have the right stuff there. Not taking enough club to get it there. Not your best effort. Still a mid-range putt coming up. Ooh, right by the hole. And this one is for bogey. And that putt will drop. Well done. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard after that effort. Welcome to this hole. That's a par four. Second shot here on the eighth. Going with the pitching wedge here. That was never really a comfortable shot for them, was it? And coming up well short. Here's a chance to get up and down from the greenside bunker. Yes, difficult light. Made a par here yesterday. A little bit more difficult today. Okay, step one complete, out of the bunker. Now let's go make a putt. Good stroke. Well done. Still in the lead now after that hole. Here we are at the final hole on the front nine. Standing on this par four and leading. What's the strategy? What's going on through their mind? Attack it or lay back? Good shot there. <laughs> A 
no harm, no foul there with that shot. Well, Rich, from where I'm sitting, this looks makeable. Do you agree? Look, I got to say, I'm really not liking their chances here, but you never know. Stranger things have happened. And down it goes. Let's head to the next. Lovely position for our leader here, Rich. Out in front, but a few holes to go. Could be some trying times indeed. Tough holes lay ahead, but yes, you're in the position that you want to be ahead of the pack. And this effort by Kevin Kisner was just a little while ago. Our current leader showing us why they're on top. Lining up for his third now. Okay, let's get back to the action. This would be a great up and down. Go ahead and make it. Just four feet remaining between him and the hole. How did that miss? His next putt is for bogey. And the putt drops, and we're moving on. Our leader is currently enjoying an eight-shot advantage. Here we have a par five. Well, this one looks to be heading down the runway. Here we have the second shot into the 11th. Uh, that's a little untidy. Getting ready to play their third. I like that, didn't you? Hasn't managed to booty this hole this week. But what a way to bounce back. Nice putt to hole. Leading by eight strokes now after that hole. Always positive coming off a birdie. Let's see what happens here. Nicely done. Time for the second shot at the 12. Looks to be going with the six iron. That's not what they were looking for. Oh, a little shorty Baker on that action there. He has this putt to save his par. Ouch, that hurts. It's just about three feet away. Well hold. Let's move on. Our current leader is enjoying an eight-stroke advantage. Time to step on your tee shot here at this long par four. Looks like this one's heading safely for the fairway. Time for the second shot here at the 13th. Seems to have chosen the three wood. And he's not hit the mark on that approach. A bit short with that effort. Oh. Heck of a shot. Got it all right on that one. Big pass over coming up for this fella. Ooh, that looks like a pure stroke. Currently in first position. And I don't give the rest of the field much hope today. Our leader is way out in front in this final round. It's time to tee off here at the 14th hole. That should find the fairway. 